was Simple Credit, but we're not gonna name this guy because I don't wanna give him no clout. Hey guys, happy when Thursday, Thursday. Memorial Day kind of threw me off. We are at the barber. Andrew just got his haircut, looking fresh. Jose's in there getting a cut, getting his long beard cleaned up because that thing was getting out of control, which I'm super excited about. Um, and then after this, we have to go find Jose some pants to wear for Saturday. And then we'll probably grab some dinner and see what else we need to do. So stay tuned for our adventures. Bye. I have to break it to Andrew. He thinks that his last day of school is tomorrow and it's really next Friday, I think. Are you sad? It's not tomorrow, kid. Trust me. He's getting a little ahead of himself. We're trying to keep him in sixth grade for as long as we can. We are not ready for seventh grade yet, at all. Mm -mm. Good thing we're bad thing. What do you mean? Like you are or I'm not? I'm not trying to send you to seventh grade yet. Why? Because that's sad. Ow, my arm's stuck. <laughs> I need you to be a sixth grader for a little bit longer. Okay, we have a week. No. I'm tired of here. If I send you to summer school, you'll still be a sixth grader. Okay, well, let's not do summer school yet. <laughs> you better behave then. Okay. Andrew, okay. tell me what you're looking forward to most this summer. Finally being able to swim again. Swim? Yeah. What else? Um... Are we doing anything this summer? Um, San Diego for a baseball for a week. I'm definitely looking forward to that. I'm not. I am. We've already done San Diego for a week for baseball. It just gets old after a couple days. Not the baseball, but there's only so much you can do in San Diego. We normally go down there a day before, stay a day after. This year, I don't think that we are. Because we're gonna be there for a week. Jose and Andrew will probably end up going longer than I do. Um, because... Wait, what? Yeah, I think you guys are gonna go down before me. Why? Because... We'll see. We have time, that's not until July. You got the World Series coming up. Yeah. It's in like three weeks. Which should be pretty fun. I mean, we're not doing the thing again. I kind of wanted to win the home run derby, but I guess there's no chance of that. You never know. Oh, my camera's dying. I better, better turn it off so we have it for later. He doesn't know that I'm recording him. Now he does. Finally, we almost died in the heat. He has to turn Andrew's hungry. He's got to go to the restroom. There's a restroom there. Thought you were going to cut it shorter. She just trimmed it out. That's it? That's a lot. I mean, that's not enough. Yeah, yeah. It was like out. Let me see. It's still long on the way. Here we go. Hey guys, so we're on our way to Brea to find this guy some pantalones. Did I say that right? Oops. <laughs> he got his hair cut and his beard trimmed. Not trimmed enough, but it'll do for now. So we will see you when we get there. Bye. Bye. Too late.
ready to pour your own shots. Hi guys. Not so close up. Go. It's recording. You're wasting my minutes. Hey, good morning guys. Today Jeez. is can't handle that energy right now. Don't Full of poop. Hey, good morning guys. So today is Friday. Um tomorrow we're just kind of getting ready for tomorrow, I should say. Uh we're going to have an event. A family event so we're we're just running errands today I'm not working uh, right now I'm going to go to the chiropractor and then just run small little errands hopefully catch some breakfast um, and then kind of just wait out the time and try to get Andrew so enjoy the day I doctor appointment no those blind people but anyways um, so stick with us and we shall see you in a little bit. Goodbye. Hey guys, happy Friday. Jose already gave you our recap, but I just wanted to come on here and thank all the new subscribers that we've got recently. Please be sure to subscribe if you're not already and hit the bell to be notified every time that we upload a video. So you could see some more of this hairy guy right here and Andrew. So stay tuned for our Friday. Peace. So we got to the chiropractor a little bit earlier and we came to get some coffee because they were not open. And Jose absolutely hates ordering my coffee. Did I say Starbucks or coffee? We're at Coffee Bean. I don't know if I said we came to Starbucks. Yeah, but I don't we're, know what you said. We're at Coffee Bean, getting some coffee. I suck at ordering, so that's the one thing I do struggle with in life. You don't suck, you're just awkward. Well, I don't know. I don't know how to say these mixed coffees. It's just an iced latte with soy. It's say it. Iced hazelnut latte with soy large. And then what's my other drink? It's the green tea matcha, or is it the same? Matcha green tea, same thing or no? Matcha green What's tea soy? latte, and then my other one. Um, don't you get like a caramel no. macchiato or something? Or is that me? Okay, I have another drink that I like. A michelada. No. <laughs> what other coffee? Come on, a white chocolate mocha with soy. With no. With. Yeah. He's Ugh. learning. He's learning. I just do black coffee. Oh. Then we got our. Oh my gosh! Why'd you break it? Put it back. It's the. And then we got our waters. It's our lunch for the day. Bullshit. Incidents. This Jose's is my water. Lunch. It's my lunch right there. Our water from yesterday that we didn't drink. That we got a drink. It's a latte with soy milk and a bit of miscopy, right? Yeah. Thank you. Give me my coffee. I'm almost gonna get hit by this car. What you know about that? Uh, I don't know. Yo no sé. Don't talk to me in Spanish, I don't know it. Hey guys, so we're at the chiropractor. I'm in the truck waiting for Jose to finish up. Then we'll probably grab something to eat and then pick up some snacks. We're doing candy apples and popcorn for tomorrow. Um, they've already been ordered by my older sister, so we're gonna go pick those up, go home. Then like Jose said, I have an optometry appointment. I finally found some new frames that I like. Um, so I'm super excited about those. I've been looking and I've probably gone to like five or six different places and haven't found the exact style that I like, but I finally did yesterday when Jose and Andrew were getting their hair cut and I was getting my eyelashes fixed um, nearby. I had a couple extra minutes, so I went into this optometry place and they had the perfect clear translucent frames that I like in the style that I love. So I made an appointment to go back today at noon. Um, and then we'll probably pick up Andrew 
get him something to eat and then head to my sister's this evening to help um, set up and clean for tomorrow. We're really looking forward to it. We're super, super excited. Um, so stay tuned as always for more video. See you soon. Bye. We are here picking up our candy apples and our popcorn. Look at that big thing of popcorn over there. It's insane. So we picked up our popcorn, got some cotton candy, some candy apples. Oh, right, you got the receipt. Come on, guy. Don't drop them, that's all we need. Yeah, open the door. You think if I yell Eric, he'll, he'll come out? <laughs> I doubt that he'll scare you. He My brother-in-law Eric works down the street and Jose thinks that we should go deliver something to him. He wanted to buy him like this 30 pound freaking 30 pound bag of popcorn. Huh? Hey guys, so we have ran our errands. I got my glasses, well ordered my glasses. Um, went to the mall to figure out something to wear tomorrow. I think I'm on like my third or fourth dress that I bought already. And now we're just at Andrew's school waiting to pick him up. Then we gotta run to Costco and head to my sister's this evening still. We have a lot to do and it's 2.15. So it's gonna be a long day today, long day tomorrow, but it's gonna be worth it and we're looking forward to it. So, we also wanted to talk about something that came to our attention. So if you guys watch our vlogs, you know that we went to Riff LA in Little Tokyo, downtown LA about two weeks ago two weeks ago may 20th about may 20th about two no about two weeks ago and we couldn't get in jose and andrew wanted to look at some shoes um every time we're in the area that's one of the places that we stop by andrew always likes to go next door and look at all the supreme stuff so we were waiting and we realized that kyrie irving was in there so they closed up shop they had everyone wait uh, we really wanted to just look at shoes, but we came across Kyrie Irving, so we figured why not um, take some video, and that's what we did. So we posted on it, we included that in our vlog, in our thumbnail, you could see pictures that I took myself, and basically other people have used our video without our permission. We saw it on Twitter, it got I think 320,000 views, we saw it on Instagram. I think it was close to 50,000 views. And then we've seen it linked in other sources where there's, um, what websites? Uh, websites posting. So Jose will give you a little bit of a recap. So we've seen it on major networks. Um, we've seen it all over Twitter, all over Instagram. And, and some people have used it on YouTube. And so the problem is it's not-, not some people. We've seen about 20 videos with our content. And, and I guess the problem that more or less bugs us is not that it's out there, it's not or that, that other people used it, or people that other people use it. I think the problem is that, you know, you're you're taking something that we've put together, and there's no credit whatsoever, and the problem is there's one specific guy mm -hmm. who really took it to a different level, put it out there, and get is getting so much kudos so many retweets and it's and it sucks because we're looking at maybe half a million in views now you know of course we're not a big channel and we're not expecting to get big overnight but that's our work and so somebody else is essentially getting credit for something that we we created and, and passing it off as their own that's the problem what other people would you know tweet it or put it out there he would respond back and say oh you're not gonna give credit well sorry dude but the credit doesn't even go to you you didn't post that video you have no rights to that video 
we're the ones that did and you want to pass it off as you're the one that actually saw it and took the video so I don't think that's fair I don't think that's cool we did talk to someone that um, did actually post the video we talked to them on Twitter and they ended up giving us credit so other people know that they did get the video from us so with something like that I think we're fine with it's just when you're trying to pass it off as your own and then getting upset at other people for not giving you credit when it's not even your video that's really crappy but I didn't make the popcorn that's our popcorn for tomorrow I think we already showed that but anyways I don't know maybe stuff like that happens but like Jose said it is kind of disappointing to see that you know someone else is trying to take credit for the hard work you know it's not easy filming getting this contact editing and and then coming across somebody who who is in the limelight who, who will be a free agent you know and, and I don't know it's, it's just not easy you know, all yeah. we're asking was simple credit but we're not gonna name this guy because I don't want to give him no clout. He doesn't deserve it, and you know it just I don't know it sucks. You know, and I'm sure other vloggers can probably sympathize with us. Um, you know, and that's the whole reason why on YouTube you can't play people's songs without getting copyrighted. You know, because it's their work. And same thing for videos, though, too. You don't know, but you know, luckily some of the people that we reached out to have been kind enough to you know kind of take it back and change the source you know where it actually came from which we'll take that but at the end of the day you know it sucks because you're looking at five you know half a mil that views. we've seen we haven't probably seen we haven't gone through everything yeah you know, we every... don't have the time honestly we looked it was a suggested video to us this morning and then we just came across about what close to 20 videos with our clips of our vlog of Kyrie Irving. So and it then, just like didn't stop. And like sports, like actual legitimate, like sports um, news channels that- Twitter pages. That have used it. A good amount of followers too. We're talking about like hundreds of thousands. Um, on Instagram, they have like three point something million. You know, that would've been cool if we would've got those views and I'm subs, but. Something. Something. Oh, uh, thank subs. you. Can you just give us a thank you, please? Jeez. Anyway, so it is what it is, guys. Um, if you come across any more of that, please let us know. We're just curious. But thank you for supporting us. All right, you guys take care. Thank you for listening to us. And make sure you guys subscribe. Hit the bell because definitely we're going to be posting more videos. And this weekend should be fun. So, you know, you guys will get to see a different side of not just us but also our families um and you know mexican parties be lit all right thank you guys take care peace